I would like to welcome you to this site event on uh, coordination emergencies and the role of clusters here at the annual session of the World Food Programme Executive Board. We're talking about true emergencies and we're talking about every minute counts. Humanitarian organizations operate in an increasingly difficult environment. Speed is really of the essence to save lives. The work of the three clusters in Mozambique improves that responding efficiently to emergency is only possible through partnership, coordination and close cooperation with the stakeholders. 94% of the people that were affected were farmers. And therefore we have here a crisis that is affecting food security because it's affecting the production of food. For most of us, the idea of not having access to internet or not being able to instantly communicate with people around you is unthinkable. But this unthinkable becomes a reality usually after a disaster. The sooner we're able to move from that situation when a critical uh, impact such as the cyclone in Mozambique which disrupts the whole of the supply chain, how quickly we can move and understand what that disruption is and what workarounds, the more effective and more efficient that operation is. The fast and efficient response in Mozambique is a reflection of strength of our partners. More than 1,800 humanitarians benefited from the ETC connectivity, which allowed them to deliver the aid to the people who needed it the most. Food insecurity is unfortunately there in the countries before the crisis very often and stay there longer and therefore our role is not only to be there quickly when there is a major crisis like in Mozambique but it's also to be able to continue to a longer term to help the population with a proper coordination. The logistics cluster is about partnership and that partnership works in many different ways. It's not just about what the logistics cluster gives to those partners in the sense of how it fills those gaps, those aircraft we take in, those bridges we repair, the roadworks that we do, but it also means of course how those partners support us. And that support, that support comes through communications, that comes through information. But it's only by working jointly with all the other clusters and certainly clusters like nutrition, WASH or health and of course our own base that make all work possible. I think it is an absolute commitment from WFP to show that we, we want to do this in partnership, we need to do this in partnership and we are only as strong as our partners are.